Colin, you must have been really pleased with the Derby win over Shelburne and Tala last week. Yeah, it's a good result. Um, particularly them being the the double champions from last year. Um, it's nice to see how we have we've developed and grown over the last couple of months. So um, to have such a such a good result is is important to the group to, to gain confidence going into this weekend. And the first two goals were from outside the box, and the third was an excellent team move played out from the back. Uh, will you take confidence from that to hopefully hurt shells the same way again on Saturday? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, particularly the third goal. It's um, it's become our trademark over the last couple of games, particularly since the break. I think we've worked really, really hard on a lot of patterns of play, so it's it's always nice to see it when it comes off. And the team had to defend for large spells of the second half. Uh, what are Shelburne's threats uh, um, we should be watching out for in the rematch? Yeah, you threats everywhere. It threats all over the park. Um, I think Mega Lynch is a good player, but Noel is probably one of the main threats that they have. She's a very clever footballer. She's a real streetwise footballer. That if you switch off for half a second, she can hurt you. So um, there's a lot of threats, particularly then as well around set pieces when, when Pearl comes off for set pieces. So um, yeah, there's, there's a lot of threats that we'll have to deal with. Uh, Orla or Matney was the only absence last week. In terms of injuries, how's everyone looking ahead of the game? Yeah, other than that, yeah, it's still... Um, same same squad as last week goes again this week. Uh, what would it mean to you, uh, your backroom staff, and all the players to reach an FA Cup final in your first season together? I, it's one. It's it's not even for for me or or the, the 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 staff. It's more for the for the players for all the hard work that they've really put in. They've um, listened to everything that me, Kieran, and. All I have thrown at them over the last couple of months. They've worked extremely hard. They've got better and better. Um, absorbed an awful lot of information, and they're playing football in a in a way that they've never played before. So, it's more. Um, I would get have great pride and, and and delight for them to get that they get the rewards that they deserve. Uh, finally, you and the team have spoken throughout the season about how the fans always play a part, and this feels like a big occasion. So, would a good crowd in Tallaght give us a bit of an edge? Absolutely. You could see it last week with, when Shells brought their crowd. The extra uh, the extra noise um, seemed to spore on the Shells team um, quite a bit. So um, it was a bit strange being in your home home ground and having the away supporters being a, uh, the loudest that were in there. So it'd be, it'd be nice now to have a good home support to help push the girls on into the final. Thanks, Colin. Thanks, Robert.